What's up, guys? We got a special edition of pack openings today for you. Uh, there's a sale going on at GameStop. Buy one, get one free on packs. So you know what we did? We went crazy. Yeah, we did. We bought packs. Holy. So we're going to do this kind of like, um, kind of like, like if you ever watch the show on TLC, Storage Wars, you, uh, you buy a, a storage unit and you spend money on it. You bid on it. Well, we didn't bid on these. Look, the concept's the same. We're going to see how much money we um, make off of these versus how much we put into it and see if we uh, won and got out on top here. So we've got eight packs of Ravnica, guilds of Ravnica, to clarify, and we've got two packs of Core 19. Let's go ahead and crack. Now, the, the unfortunate side of these blister packs like this from the game stores is that there are any retail shop, you've got double, yeah. double packing. You've got... The cardboard, and you've got the pack inside. So let's just start with Core 19. It's the older set right now. We'll we'll cut all this out and just get to the pack itself. I say keep it. So keep it. You keep all that. Oh, that was actually easier to open than I thought. All right, first pack, Core 19. There's still some cards we actually could use from Core 19. It was a good yeah. set. There's some good stuff we could use. Let's go ahead and see. All right, we've got Tectonic Rift, Blanchwood Armor, Surge Mare. A chaos wand. Oh, jeez. Pack one, bust one. <laughs> Surge Mare, not a bad card. Um, but there's... Oh, my gosh! And there's nothing really else in that pack that we really want. No. That was... That was... Let's just say that was the the free one from the buy one, get one. <laughs> let's just say... Um, the uh, let's see what we got here. Oh, Goblin pick, Instigator! If hey, this was draft, um, I am picking Surge Mare. Surge Mare is a good card, especially in draft. Poison Tip Archer, that one's being used lately. Crucible of Worlds. Ooh. Wow. All right. There we go. So we got a Poison Tip Archer, which is um, showing up in a lot of Golgari builds right now. And Crucible of Worlds. So not awful, actually. This pack, uh, this pack, let's say this is the pack we paid for, not the free one. So decent pack. Crucible of Worlds. I'm, I'm not upset by that. All right. Let's get into some Guilds of Ravnica. Got Demir Dave on the cover of this one. Yeah, Crucible's uh twelve bucks. Twelve dollar card? Yeah. Uh, not too bad. No, I don't have anything. Jeez, okay. So we've already made our almost half the value that we put into this. Because yeah. we spent about I spent about twenty bucks on this today. Alright, let's see. This is this is what I'm I'm curious about right now. Alright. Might of masses. Oh, sir uh sure. circuitous route. route. I actually need that for the um Dinosaur build that I'm working on. Oh, yeah. Oh, look, Demir Spybug and a Zony oh, Thousand Eyes. Womp, womp. But pack one, pick one. If this was draft, Demir Spybug. Yeah, Demir Spybug's for sure. But this one actually is pretty good, too, for uh, the dinosaur build that I'm working on because you got Search Your Library for up to two basic lands or gate cards. Put them on the battlefield tapped, then shuffle your library. So, so uh, yeah, what is that? Our 10th Izonia? Oh, yeah, I've just gotten so many of those. I got foil as well. I think I do too. Yeah. <laughs> that was the rare they're apparently giving out in Ravnica. All right. Ravnica pack two. Let's go. Dead weight. Okay, here we go. Join shields. Rampaging monument. Hellkite whelp. Oh. Oof. Response for surgeons. Yeah, I think between me and you, we're drowning in them because I tried Are it for like oh, four of them I don't think a I have. weeks I think ago. I got like one. It's a good Boros card to deal damage and kill a creature, but I mean yeah. that would be my pack one pick one. Not, uh, not astounding. It's a fifty cent card. Yeah, but not astounding. It's still good. For, it's still a useful card. This card. This is a yeah. fun card right now, especially in some of these dragon builds we're working with, or these is it? Um, is it Drake's? Fling a fling a Drake with like fifteen damage at someone. Ooh, Healer Hawk. Healer Hawk. This is okay. a real pick. Dead weight. Undercity uprising. Direct current. Right, Join shields. Oh, we got a foil in here. Oh, God. Conclave Tribunal. Pilfering Imp. Gruesome Menagerie. It's, oh, man. That's our second Tajik. Oh, we got a foil Tajik. Tajik did nothing wrong. Tajik stole nothing. We got a foil Tajik. I already have one, too. I don't. So, I, I now have a foil Tajik. So, I'm... Man. But Tajik awful. is my pick one, I, I think, on that yeah. one. Yeah, on that one. It's a tough ah! card between that, the yeah, Tribunal, and the Healer Hall, so... All right, here we go. Ugh. Ugh. Preferably one of them is getting passed back in right. that pack. Uh, I call her the call, bro. Brazil. I always call it Brazilian bats. Brazil wax. Dead weight. We've gotten a dead weight in almost every pack, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Rock Charger. Crackling, Crackling Drake. Drake. Creeping, Creeping chill. chill. 
Errata yeah. the Silencer. Eh, not a bad card. Cracking Drake. That's my But pick. yeah, I mean, Crackling Drake and uh, Creeping Chill is actually a pretty good card, too. I've seen some really good plays out of Creeping Chill recently in the um, some drafts online. A lot of people are starting to play that card, especially because it does that three damage, and then if it yeah. mills, and if it, you mill it, from your <laughs> you do three damage as well. It, it's a free, free damage. It's a free, free. And three damage. It's a six point life. Yeah. Oh look, radical idea. Oh cool. All right, all right, all right. Nope, nope, nope. Oh lava coil, Ooh. bringing that. That's trade value right now. Those are hot. Lost giant, Golgari fine broker, light of the legion, spinal. Oh foil spinal centipede. I was like, why oh, is there nice. a common back here? Uh, but yeah, Light of the Legion. It's not a terrible card. It's expensive, but Lava Coil is honestly the yeah. That's my that's the my bigger pick. money card in this pack. If we if we draft that and I open it, that's my pick. Lava Coil's going in the hand. We got three more packs. Not terrible. I mean, the Crackling Drake, the Lava Coil. We got a few cards that are in demand, so we got some trade power. Yeah. Because we got play sets, multiple play sets in both of those now. All right, all right. Dead weight again. <laughs> and Undercity uppercut. Every pack. We've Dead had weight, Deadweight, Undercity Dead Uprising, and Parhelion. True Fire Captain, Night Vale Sprite, District Guide, Um Spell Adapt. Wah, wah. Night Vale Sprite is my pack, my pick. Yeah. In draft. Yeah. If yeah. I'm wrong, I'm wrong, but. Two packs, guys. Two packs left, but Crucible Worlds probably our best. Yeah, that's a pretty good pull. Because that's the only one I actually wanted to look up. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's see. Vicious Rumors. Direct Current again. Goblin Electromancer, we need that. Integrity Intervention, Hazada Marshall, Swath Cutter Giant, Steam Vents! Steam Vents, oh man, and a foil pelt collector. What? What? Hold on to that bitch. Man, at the beginning, when, when pelt collectors first came out, that would have been, what, like a $25 card? Yeah, but it, I think it's going to go It might come up, up. yeah. We set. might start seeing some okay, more Okay, that's a $15 card. Steam Vents? Yep. Steam Vents, folks! Steam vents! Oh. Between this and between our Crucible of Worlds, we have more than paid for I, our set. I might have to borrow that steam vents tonight. Nope. No, that's fine. <laughs> I'm actually I actually own two sets of steam vents already. And hold on to them. Never oh, let no, no, never yeah. let the steam vents go. Because even then they're still great and modern. Alright guys, last pack. Last pack, Am I feeling it? Am I feeling it? Am I feeling anything? Watch it. I'm feeling Doom Whisper in this one. Dad be Mainly because I want a Doom Whisper. Parhelion Patrol again! Garrison Sart. Oh, look! Flower Flourish. I'm drowning in those. Selective Snare. Legion Guild Mage. Gruesome Menagerie. And a. Vernadi. Vernadi? Vernad? Vernadi? Vernadi? I don't know. But your Pelt Hey, look, yeah. But your Pelt Collector is six bucks. Uh, look. Um, I'm go okay, let's just go ahead and lay this out because we'll go ahead and post this. Make sure you check out our Instagram. Uh, GNDMTG is our new Instagram account. Uh, we'll be posting the results on there as well, but I mean, come on, you know, There's some uh, decent trading power right now. I mean, we're looking at these cards, Lava Coil, you know, uh, Creeping Chill, Crackling Drake. Um, what else do we have in here? Conclave Tribunals are being used a lot still. Tajik did nothing wrong. Uh, Rampaging Monument, Cir Circus Rivers, I need. Demir Spy Bugs, my of the Masses has actually worked out well, and, um... Crucible of Worlds. So, not awful. Some decent cards. Let's focus that camera there. Some decent cards, though. Not too bad for the pull. So there you go, guys. That is our uh, value-wise what? I mean, just between three cards, we're at... Three cards, uh, Steam Vents 15, 25, Crucible of Worlds 27, 27, and then the Pelt Collector makes it 32. 30, $30 in value, and I paid about $20 for all these cards. So I'm not upset. I think it was a good pull. Overall, uh, not some of the cards we really wanted, but some cards that are definitely got some trade value and just straight cash value um, and pretty cards like foil pelt collectors. So, yeah, overall, good pack. Uh, GameStop, buy one, get one sale was, uh, was a win. I'd say we ended successfully. So, yeah, let us know what you think. Let us know if you need any of the cards. We're always willing to trade, except for Steam Vents. And uh, tune in next time. Thanks for checking out another unboxing. And may your top deck always be mythic.